Drivers in Massachusetts and all across the nation are feeling the pain at the pump as gas prices continue to rise. But it's, uh, it's ridiculous. According to AAA, prices have risen steadily for the past 36 days at an average of 4 cents a week. With a national average of 3.77 per gallon, many drivers may be wondering what is causing the hike. Economist Miguel Conclavis believes that the rising cost of oil is to blame. Essentially, most of the price uh, that you see in the pump it comes from oil prices, right? So, given the oil price, uh, oil is the feedstock to uh, for the refinement and production of gasoline. Uh, uh, whatever happens in, in the oil market is going to be reflected on the on the gas prices. The good news is the rise in prices may only be temporary. Mr. Conclavis believes that once oil prices fall, gas prices will follow. Given that the tendency now is for the oil to go down a little bit, a couple of dollars are going to go down um, in the next few weeks, that that's what we are expecting, then uh, you will see that the, pri the, oil, the gasoline prices at the pump are going to go down. In the meantime, drivers are still struggling to keep up with the rising prices at the pump. You know, and I see people at work that commute an hour back and forth, and it just costs them, you know, it's, it's almost not worth it. A lot of them have gone and gotten other jobs because it's just too far for them to spend, you know, the money on gas. Overall, the national average has written about 44 cents in the past 36 days. The price in Massachusetts stands at 378, but many stations like the one behind me is as high as 389, causing a burden for many drivers. For BUTV 10, this is Carla Torres.